Uh, well, I'm not entirely sure what their mindset was. I do, I do think that at, at the very least, you had three Supreme Court justices in the in the Colorado level that felt that this was a violation of due process. Donald Trump has neither been charged nor convicted of insurrection, and Jack Smith had the opportunity to bring those charges, but he chose not to. So, in light of that, uh, using it as a reason to dismiss Donald Trump from the Colorado ballot was certainly premature, and in this case. Um, shocking and unprecedented and, and not warranted. <laughs> you, you know, uh, from a party perspective, we certainly don't think it was the best move. We felt that she was uh, best suited for Congressional District 3 and that she was uh, in the best position to win re-election and retain that for Republicans. Time will tell whether or not we're right, but I think she's got a serious challenge on her hands uh, trying to explain to the voters of CD4 why uh, she felt it was necessary to leave CD3 and and uh, have a better chance at keeping her seat in Congress. It's a it's kind of a problematic proposition, but it's uh, again, it's something for the voters to decide.